In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert any anthropometric dimension to any percentile value. Uh, for example, we are designing a door height. Let's say we want to convert that. We want to feed 99% of the population. In that case, we might need a value of 99 percentile person. So this is the U.S. mail height data. I have collected that from one of the most recent data published by the Center for Disease Control. I'll post a link in the openeducator.com so you can see where I got this data from. Now, to convert this mean value, mean means 50 percentile, to any standard, um, any percentile. So you have to get that mean value. Also, you have to extract the standard deviation. Now, in that particular data set, it only gives you a standard error. Now, to find a standard deviation from a standard error, you do the, the standard error times the square root of the sample size. Then you can write, there is a function called norm inverse um, I'm just typing it uh, caps lock because it's easy to see. It doesn't have to be caps lock. Norm dist, and then I want to find the height associated with one percentile male. So one percentile, so that's one divided by 100. That gives me the probability value. Excel norm dist cannot take percentile, so it has to be out of one. So 1 divided by 100, that's 1 percentile. Now mean value, select the mean, uh, comma, and then select the standard deviation, then close the parentheses, so that. So 61 inches is the height of an 1 percentile male, US male. Now I want to calculate all of this, so what I'm going to do, I'll, using this, I'll be using the same mean and standard deviation for all the calculation. So I'll freeze that, I'll freeze that mean and standard deviation cell and then simply copy all the way down. So this is the height for a 99 percentile male, 78 uh, inches, which is 72, so that's 6 feet 6 inches um, is the height of a 99 percentile male. So this is how you convert any 50 percentile mean value and standard deviation to any population percentile um, whatever you need for that particular design.